Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very good uh, morning as well as a happy morning to all in this video. I think so since regularly we are updating about Sushra energy, Oring Green Power and Ratan Power energy, people may, I mean people uh, don't think like we are just only focusing on these videos. But the main problem that I want to also want to say make here is that uh, my friends are holding for the past six months after uh, what is the so called listening to these previous videos and they are minting money right now. At this stage, if we don't say at what level to exit or what level they could book profit, it would be difficult for them to retain their profit. So only I am discussing about these many stocks. And as well as understand one thing, the time has come now to really discuss because we recently saw right, the 30 gigawatt project in which uh, 4750 megawatt has been allocated to Suzuran Energy in Gujarat. I think that is one of the main main path breakthrough things the Suzuran is having. Understand one thing, the momentum started on 15th of December. If this momentum is going to go for another 9 days, which means that Switzerland is going in upper circuit for almost 15 days, in between we saw, uh, that's what I said, right? There will not be any continuous upper circuit, okay? Luckily, what has happened is that many times uh, within an intraday itself, the lower circuit has been converted into an upper circuit, which means there is a tremendous buying power. History also when the market was down, right? Some of my picks or some of my friends' holdings, including Ratan Power India Limited, Suzlon Energy, Oring Green Power, Basant Agro, B-Cell Industries, Sama Phosphates. I think these are the various picks recently we discussed, right? They didn't fall much. So, which in kit, in, I mean, which what to say, so-called uh, said to me that okay, some there is a buying pressure in the market. And yesterday also when the uh, during the market uh, so-called pressure and the lower circuit was broken and Suzlon, I mean the, the upper circuit was broken on Suzlon Energy, people started to accumulate the share. I mean, if they, if, they, if they have accumulated at 4 rupees, then I would have been normal. But when they have accumulated at 8 rupees, right, it's going to be very, very important. Today, when the share is going to go up to 8.23 as per the opening mark, so which means basically if you multiply or if you divide or if you add, uh, there is almost a 40 paise momentum per share in the momentum. So which means if you compare with the market capital, 800 into 4, if you get 320 crores of market capital would be added so which means basically 6900 or 6950 that is the market capital it, it would be going so if this kind of moment is going to be carried for another two more days my dream valuation of Switzerland energy 9 rupees and 11 paise would be finally achieved I mean I will I mean I, I, I always said that I would not sell the share I mean I will not tell the share price but uh, whenever say a valuation, 1 billion valuation, which means 7500 crore, try to divide the 7500 crore by the remaining existing shares in the market so that you could get a so called idea. And one more thing that I want to discuss here is that uh, the exceptional gains that the company could even earn in quarter 4 result. It has been recently also the company converted uh, their uh, so called US currency foreign convertible bonds into Indian uh, Suzerain energy shares. So which means basically they would they would get an uh, so called uh, exceptional gain in foreign currency and that is really very very important one which could add to the profit and uh, yes you could argue with that uh, uh, exceptional gain is not a kind of profit to the company but under something I think they have some reserves in negative so that they could clear their reserves in negative and having a surplus profit for almost two quarters and increasing the market capital. Now, people will not consider Suzuran Energy to be a small cap company or you, call, you can call it as any way company because I think the market capital has increased in such a way that the market capital is, I mean the Birla software market capital as well as Suzuran Energy market capital is at the same level right now. So, I think the company is growing uh, but we need to mainly focus on the one point that we want to discuss here. What a trader should do at this level as well as, well as what an investor should do at this level. A trader who has bought it 4 rupees would have been making money right now. So try to exit the shares which could give you a capital back to you. That would be a normal trader uh, or the so called momentum. A risky trader, what one should do? I mean whatever happens I will hold my positions. But somewhat I want to make some profit means try to exit 25% of your holdings. Suppose you are holding 1000 shares. If you have bought it 5 rupees, 6 rupees, 7 rupees uh, or even at 4 rupees. Try to exceed 25% of your holdings so that the risk conversion could come down. Because I think many people would have feared when the share was going into a so-called lower circuit yesterday. I mean, to a day before yesterday and a circuit break yesterday. But understand one thing, at both at these levels, someone was buying. If 
on the time where of 3 months back when we said to hold the shares when the market was hammering no suzlan and ji where nobody was ready to buy the share at that time and the share was going into lowest secure but at 7 rupees someone is putting his own money and buying 50 lakh share at the single time then understand the real valuation of the company and understand what and why it did uh what to say so called made the company to go up to that level so when the share is going to cross i think from today I mean, unless or until it crosses this eight rupees barrier, it's going to be difficult. I know because, uh, oh, I mean, what to say? One or two years back or three years back, when finally I sold uh, Susan Energy at eight rupees, I remember I mean, because uh, after this only these main problems arise, the debt resolution process came. But I understand that this eight rupees level is a very, very so-called difficulty level for. Uh, Susan Energy to cross. So from eight rupees, uh, five paise to nine rupees, unless and until it crosses this barrier, right, is going to be difficult. But market can do wonders. Market can definitely do wonders. The main thing why I am saying this because U.S. Senate election. I think the Democrats have won because 48 seats, two seats plus other parties. So if you uh, there will be a tie in the U.S. Senate. So Vice President will cast up one vote. So 51 votes. The law could be easily passed in U.S. and how is this going to help uh, our Indian companies or all over the world global companies? Their main focus us is on renewable source of energy. So our picks, Susan Energy, Ratan Green, I mean Ratan uh, Energy is also a combination of uh, non-renewable source of renewable. Orion Green Power also is a windmill energy. Solar star I didn't select because Susan is having a, Susan itself having a solar thing with it. So I think these are the various key factors that could play the momentum because Susan Energy wants the momentum to or the so-called break the single-digit barrier and grow into a different valuation, which could provide a value for stakeholders. And yesterday at 1:57 p.m., a stock case in this asked to Susan, "Why your share is continuously rising? Are you, I mean, are you are you avoiding any material facts?" So Susan Energy clarified that there is no any material fact to discuss. So we are in what is it? So-called interrelations with the acts or successes things. But whenever these things came from, uh, so, I mean, came from stock exchanges, a share will try try to go into lower circuit because of the price momentum. But I think even after that, you know, Switzerland is going to enter upper circuit, so which indicates to me that something is very very cooking for okay, uh, Switzerland. See, basically that uh, what is it? So-called uh, uh, 30 gigawatt project. And I now request my friends, and I really request my friends right now. Recently, when we discussed with you regarding the 30 gigawatt, uh, what is a renewable so uh, power project in uh, Gujarat, I didn't say it about the capital amount or the so-called amount. Now I request you, my friends, kindly do some research work. I I am also doing the research work to get some the capital amount of the total or say so-called the total cost allocated for the 30 gigawatt project. If my friends could get any idea regarding the 30 gigawatt process, the total cost for all the 30 gigawatt, we could find the average for 4750. At least we could get the average, not an exact amount. It is going to be very very important for Suzlan Energy. Okay, so thank you friends, and see you in the video very soon with a happy face. Bye.